What's going on, interwebs? Welcome to another Unknown Creation. I am Josh. Thanks for checking out the channel. And tonight, again, on Ark Survival Evolved. So, there's been a lot going on <laughs> in the RL, if you will. Uh, I have probably a week or two weeks in between last recording and this recording. Uh, I have gotten a lot done, but I've not been able to record things. Just been out of town with work or getting home late and hopping on when I could in places where I'm just not shut up to do any recording really so uh, out of town with a laptop or you know shitty hotel internet so tonight we are back on we got some big plans probably gonna group up with another another mate on the server not in a tribe but we're gonna go try to do probably some stuff together it's a secret for right now maybe we'll get to it let you know in a bit <laughs> see if it's actually going to happen if not uh we'll just go do it solo so thanks again uh if you like the episode please throw me that thumbs up and if you're new go ahead and subscribe to the channel all right so so far we'll just uh we'll just i guess we'll show you all the new stuff so we got them all both of these guys we you've seen them they're they're crammed in the corner uh, i've got couple forges I've been going all night actually or for two days now <laughs> uh, we'll just go ahead and bash these into there get some metal put away really actually let's do it this far still some that needs to be smelted uh, I did throw both of them uh, in that corner over there by the bed so I can smack down a, another forge. I did all of the metal, basically, that we've ever done with just those two forges. And it was, actually, it was, it was, it was yesterday I was on. And I decided it's time to get an industrial size forge. So I did all that, and then I did one full smelting run with this forge over here to just knock out that. I don't know what was this like 2,500 metal or whatever it is to to you know craft a forge so and that's the this is the remaining of it. That being said, we got I just spoiled a little bit of the secret. Got a little system going on. Oh, I, I don't know if you could tell our smithy is empty <laughs> because we have actually done some work and I, it, it's gonna look like I did it overnight, but it has taken a long time to get what I got done all the base stuff so just gonna move some stuff around here and then we can get to showing you everything that happened alright just smack that all in there be nice and neat like that boom boss so we don't really have anything new there finally cooked up some mutton took so long to do that um, just some uh, some of our eggs. I think I want to use these these eggs. Yeah, to maybe train tame up some trodons. I've never been able to I've failed miserably uh, on old servers when they first dropped. They're my favorite dinosaur of all time. Love just my favorite. But we also had tamed up a scorpion. We tamed up a couple of them, and apparently I left one out in the wild somewhere, like where I guess where I tamed it, and it died like a week later. I was online and got the message. Didn't even know I had it. Forgot all about it, but still got one and moved it in. So, we'll go ahead and let's get to showing you all the new stuff. So, this stone building is the same. And we had a fabricator over here, and it's now gone, because we've done moved it. There's a scorpion. That laid us an egg, and we still have our cooking stations back here. So we got two Rexes. I'm not sure if, <laughs> if you guys even saw the second Rex or not. Again, I apologize. I don't remember where the last bit of recording was or what was even the last bit of a couple bits of recording. Just been so busy with real life, so just going to recap everything. Got our first tame here, still alive. She is basically just a storage unit right now <laughs> got our u tyrannus and our stego and over it we have another uh, waterfall over there and that's where the trike is and that is probably going to be our uh 
hatchery, incubation room, and nursery, or whatever you want to call it. I call them incubation rooms. We'll stick with that. So, if you didn't notice on the uh, Sabertooth how our original tribe was what it was, and now you can see we're in the tribe order of and got a name change. Uh, so, in the process of getting a new tribe, changing the name, I also had a buddy find me a 150 rock elemental. I tamed it up, did not do it on camera. Got it killed. Gigas kill those things pretty easy. Found a 145, tamed that guy up. So, we've got one. We have tried to tame another one, but a buddy had already started taming it and it broke his cannon so we went to try to have a go at it and just two shots or it was maybe even one shot just missed the head first shot or no it was two shots missed the head first shot hit the head second shot but it was enough to kill it he had already pretty much gotten the thing killed there is another one out there. there's a 95 out there right now i know where it's at want to tame them up we want to tame a few of them up get some good base defense going but um yeah so this was uh this guy was tamed right in the process of switching tribes and and every or changing the you know the tribe name and everything so also went on another <laughs> wyvern hatching and i think there was five that second go so the first time we did it i did it off camera again we got these two twins, got a few more, and I've traded some wyverns for some stuff. We've made some trades for the lower level wyverns, but this was a 190. This was a 180 poison, and this was a 180 fire. So we got our two high, high levels there. We've tamed up all the griffins we could. This is another 135, along with Tails and Gruffin. And this one was a 140, so that was pretty exciting to find a 140. And now we just have too many because we got one over there, which was another 135. We've got two otters, and don't worry, guys, I did it off camera, but I want to tame and breed a bunch more. So no worries, don't you worry. We'll show how to how to tame those up because those are brand new to Xbox. Uh, original two wyverns and a pretty good poison and here's atlas up here because i've died and <laughs> he was the only way to get or she i think that's a she she was the only way to get up here to <laughs> get two of the flyers so on to the rest of it so i said i put together and smelted a bunch of stuff and was able to just get enough metal to give us our forge this is going to be our forge or smelting room we're gonna fully enclose it don't you worry we're gonna have a little crafting station or something some boxes but i p offset it a little bit placed it in the orbital camera uh, as best i could offset it and there seems to be some good room here but well yeah we'll get this all built up there's gruffin he's been helping us out with the weight tails is still great to go do everything with all that stamina uh, i also found a, i can't remember if i did it on camera but found a couple ice wyverns and this was still before the they were while they were bugged and before they got fixed so we have a couple ice wyverns oh i just fell off that's all right we'll uh yeah we'll get you later so this was our first one i think it was a 90 or a 95 egg that's what we got raised it uh all went well and this one was a 180 as you can see there's the levels a 180 he's got some pretty good stats too pretty excited pretty excited to have her have a couple of them so i think we're going to be done with ice or with wyverns in general for a bit uh, i can maybe just you know pop in and see because wouldn't be bad to have the highest level of each one we only have the highest level of the lightning right now so we got our Doty over here, just helping us a lot with stone, and then there it is. It's the big surprise, everybody. Our base is coming together. <laughs> like it's still not finished, but we're trying to do it right, you know, proper do this base and uh, laying down foundations, uh, doing double walls and pillars, and it is in a cave, so I know there's gonna be six times. There's not been much PvP on the server at all, so you know, not sure if that's ever gonna take off. 
but just to be safe and probably going to surround the whole thing obviously with defenses and uh, but probably more than likely surround the whole thing with pillars so people can't just walk up and blow a hole straight in this they have to waste it on pillars that are offset a little bit you know good good defenses and I don't have to go super well maybe I will have to go super high that's higher than it looks or than I thought it was I uh, got one of these tamed up too had a what is this? A Mastercraft saddle? Yep. Found a Mastercraft saddle and a drop, so went and tamed one of these up. Super easy. But they're a neat little animal to have, so we got one. So that's it. I can show you the base and get a good idea of the layout, what's going on. Yep, told you. Doing it proper. Actually. Doesn't look like anybody's on, so. Alright, so just place this haven't even put any fuel in it got our dimorph in here I got our couple three beds there maybe I don't know I uh, then have around the corners our crafting station so we got four smithies and two two fabs two fabricators so this is our crafting station this is our generator and this, I'm not sure what we're going to do. I think I'm going to put some vaults here and make this the vault room. And this can maybe be more storage over here. I may take this wall down or, and redo it. Not sure. It was just kind of put up there. I, I started with the crafting station over here. And I figured I didn't like that as much for defensive reasons. So I moved it to the back corner and then closest to the middle. So that's that's everything. So anyway, so the big surprise tonight is I think we're going to go try and oh, we're going to try it. We're going to try to do the ice cave. We're going to try to run it. See what we got to run it. But I don't know if we're going to actually try to go do the queen. I was uh I've just done some, you know, looking some watching YouTube videos and I think there's a path you can actually take in the cave. Where you don't have to drop down and actually fight your way through the ice queen to exit and you can just go kill a few worms now you may not be able to get all the red drops but you just kill a few worms and then you can turn around and leave and that would be very helpful to get the death worm spikes so that way we can get some mantis and because they're pretty cool i've never ever tamed one of them but i i looked up you know the app shows them as as the second best gatherer for every resource so that would be awesome pretty neat to have a uh, mantis or a couple mantis as well as can stop taming rock golems for <laughs> with sulfur and actually use mantis kibble that is what i'm more excited about and that's why i haven't gotten myself an, another golem that 95 that's sitting there i'm not grinding out to get that one yet i've gotten the two got the one killed i've also helped a buddy tame his, his and i gifted one to my brother as well as a couple wyverns too so i think we've hatched up 14 wyverns total given the rest away so whatever you see here is what we have left and so i've given my brother a couple and then tamed a golem for him and gave it to him it was a level uh, 20 maybe i think 20 or 25 so, so done a couple of them and i think going and getting the horns or the death worm spikes are now going to be what we should do so we can go ahead and get the golems we want we'll put them on turret mode be good defense and good effectiveness a lot better effectiveness than sulfur so that's the plan so i'm gonna get to some grindy stuff get ready see uh, see exactly what we're gonna do and i'll bring you back as soon as we're we're ready to go all right i need to get down there and get some black pearls i think that's where they all are <laughs> maybe not all of them so you know we can't resist these drops I love the red ones we're gonna go into the get some more here but gotta stop and get these oh that's you with the ring perfect uh do also have a couple new sea dinos we got the basil fish uh, i forget what it was 140 maybe 145 got that on mutton and then uh, a few days later, used that to go get ourselves an anglerfish, which was a bit of a mish. Killed the first couple, 
finally got one though. It was a good, it was a good level, like 130, 135. So it turned out to be good. That's uh, all we can ask for. So we can now properly go get some silica pearls and t tank eels and and those baddies under the water. That was good. What was that? Yeah, starting to get. You can see a fur up. We're gonna go check out the drops in the f cave. I do have an awesome idea. I want to get another thylo, a male thylo, to mate with ours. And what level are you? Um, that's a good one. Oh, jeez, there we go. Some lag there. And walk it into the cave. And then use a thylo to tank and kill all the death worms. That way we don't have to do it on foot. We could just leave it on passive up on the side of the wall somewhere and be out of somebody's way. Last uh, last map I had a thylo and it was the, the best thing. I, it was on the island and I honestly never flew anywhere. So I loved everything about it. It, 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 was, it tanked everything for me. We went out and killed everything. So I think that'll be a good idea to bring with us. What is that? Wow, ascended hide. <laughs> Do we take it just because it's ascended? And uh, Equus saddle. I have a better one, and <laughs> we don't need hide gear. We're good. Let's go ahead and do my little route. I should run this little route in here more often to get stuff, but I don't. Oh, yellow one. Nice. Ooh. Are they too close? I think we'll be all right. No, we won't. Oh yeah, we're good. Not too afraid of the bears. All right, so we got dire bear. Well, look at that. Speak of them. And hide gloves, mastercraft. I took them. Let's go ahead and pitch them. All right, that bear hits pretty good. We're avoiding conflict. To the next drop, and it's yellow. Woohoo! We're getting lucky. A lot of times when I make my runs in here, they're blue, all of them. So this is nice to have just a couple yellow. And nothing good. A manta saddle. Ah, oh, I'm gonna leave it. Drop it. I don't want it. Is that yellow again? Nice. Is that one yellow too? Wow. Glad I'm doing this on camera. <laughs> I've never gotten this lucky. Alright, what do we got? Diplodocus saddle. No thanks. I'll kill him. Not gonna tame one. And this is the last one here. Give us something good. Oh, there's something good there. A Doty. We got a, a good one. And Megatherium. That's pre-made. Let's take that because it's pre-made. I want to get a grinder. That's the goal. Get a grinder and grind these pre-made stuff up. I don't know anything about the grinder though. So here's the entrance. Let's go have a look. Maybe kind of get an idea of what... Oh, that's it. Oh, I did know that. You can't take your flyer all the way down. Um, okay. So... Hmm. I love where are these bears? 90, 180, 190. Okay. Let's see if we can. Let's see if we can kill them real quick. Got one of them. Hey, you're taking my loot. You're eating your buddy. There we go. Oh, didn't take. There we go. Good, good, good. Alright. What do we got here? You got one more in you? 
<laughs> All right, so I'm just gonna leave you here. You're on passive, but I ain't too bothered by it. You're fine. So here's the entrance. I've never gone here. What? Are these supposed to be the worms that are doing this? Oh, look, they're in holes. Yeah, it must be. Oh, man. Oh, boy. Look at all the blood. All right, so here's the entrance. So here's my plan. Boss is available. Well, good. I don't think anybody's ever attacked it. So I don't think there's any death worms in this part. If there are, we're running. Actually we do have this let's let's go ahead just in case we are nowhere prepared although we are not cold so I bet we could substitute some flack out for some of this stuff which is awesome so right here is the first Y and I thought you could only go this way which drops you down I think Wait, what's up here? Oh, that's cool. I could keep a thylo here. Perfect. Which drops you down, and then there's death worms, and you can't get back up, and obviously can't use grapples in this cave. So. Sorry, I'm getting a little nervous. I've never been in here. And I think death worms are anywhere right now. And I didn't even bring a sleeping bag to pop it outside next to the griffin. I've been told you can see them with your spyglass. Ooh. Or this. People say you can see them this way. So far, I don't see anything, but I don't think that's a f sure way to tell. That scared the hell out of me. I'm not going to be able to do this. Oh, run, 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 run. That thing hit me hard. Oh, boy. Run this way. Oh, man. That scared the hell out of me. <laughs> Sorry, I kind of clammed up there and stopped talking. That scared the shit out of me. My heart is racing. I was not ready for that. Obviously, I didn't have my shield out. Uh, um, well, I want to have another go at it. What's the temperature? Negative six. Not too bad. This armor is pretty good. But I bet I could do it with flak and otters. That might be a good way to do it. So I literally just came down here to <laughs> to grab those drops at the entrance and was not expecting this. I'm supposed to be running this later with a buddy. Uh, armor's good. Shield's not. Shield's not good at all. Wow, those things hit a shield hard. Harder than I think the rock golems did. It wasn't full to begin with, but... bet we have a pretty good shotgun I bet we could do it with a shotgun
Oh boy, I'm stuck. Yep. Oh man, I got stuck there. I couldn't I couldn't move. Let's see what we can do here. So let's leave it here. Can't place structure here. I bet we can't place one in this whole thing. Oh, that's going to be hard to mate those things and I'm going to have to make some sort of, oh, it's actually getting cold. Um, what am I stuck on? Wow, this is ground here all buggy. Can't play structure. Yeah. Okay. All right. I bet this whole cave's off limits for structure building. So, no use trying it and no use dying with it on. And I feel the same way about 50 of these. <laughs> Alright, I think we can't get hit. That's the thing, so we gotta be careful. And we are reloaded. If we're quick enough, we might be able to. Because, well, I did make it bloody. Okay. <laughs> Trying to lure him out. I wonder if we can see it now. Oh, wrong way. So there's body. I don't see him, but I don't think, I don't know how good this trick actually is, to be honest. Um, yeah, I know I'm freezing. All right, let's see. Oh, yes, we got it. Barely. But we got it. It counts. All right, let's get let's get our stuff on. You, 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 you. Um drop you and eat 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 it all. Oh, no, the can we get it, please? Huh, yes. Yes. Well, we can take that. And is it worth harvesting, actually? Okay. Awesome. 